Here at Harding Eye College in West Sussex, there has been an amazing discovery. The discovery of dinosaur bones over 140 million years old. Now we speak to Brian Smith, head technician at Harding Eye College. So we are really interested in you, and, and it's great that you're all here as well. It's, it's fantastic. So this is uh, the chance for Arden Lai, as citizen, like a citizen science project, to really help uh, research of the wild and fossils in this area. This is Susanna Maidman, a professor from Imperial College London. Um, and what we're really trying to do um, with these fossils that we found is to help us collect as much of this material as possible um, so that we have the best chance of finding some really interesting things um, and, and getting a really good understanding of, of, of what was actually living here. This is one I just found down here. So this is the kind of stuff. I think these are probably mostly plant remains, actually. But I just picked that up just down there. Uh huh. Um, and you can see this is the kind of thing oh, that we're. I can see them now. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Little. Oh, they're, they're little tiny things, but they're actually they tell us so much about the environment. We've had quite a range of finds. One of our finds of a tooth um, identified uh, up at Imperial College. We've also got a number of plant finds, ferns, and. Um, Sort of ancient plants that were around at the time. The Dino Dig at Arden Lai College is a great example of citizen science. Citizen science is a project where the general public can get involved. So far, many people from the local community and local schools have visited and helped us discover fossils from over 100 million years old. We are trying to set up a website very soon. Arden Lai College's dinosaur finds have attracted attention from other news crews such as BBC South East Today and Newsround. We are hoping to attract even more visitors at ArtsFest. So please get involved. This is a clear example of citizen science at its best, where the community gets involved altogether. This is Kate and James. Thank you for watching our school report.